somebody asked me why don't I do longer videos now so I'm going to do that today it's gonna to be like a chit chat um, sort of get ready with me get ready with me to film type video so I already did my brows I have a separate tutorial on that um, because um, a lot of people may ask about my brows and if my face looks ashy already I already primed my face with my wet and wild all over face primer so now I'm going to color correct with LA Colors Pro Concealer in orange corrector so I definitely need to put it here because I haven't had my lip wax in a while so yeah I'm gonna just put it around here and since we're talking let me tell you about one time when um, I did videos probably like maybe last year or year before last somebody actually commented on my video and said oh I can't watch your videos anymore because um, the hair curves around your lip uh, bothers me or whatever I thought that that was the funniest thing ever so of course I blocked there but it's like it really irritated you that bad so where you couldn't watch my makeup tutorial like that bad I mean I could see if I had like staying breath coming through the camera or whatnot, but hair around my lip, really? So I blocked her so she didn't have to see my mustache anymore. But she probably created another account and she's, you know, probably watching, but yeah, she tried it, <laughs> basically. But um, I should have told her I had a PayPal account and um, she could donate and I could get my lip done. Wouldn't irritate her that much, you know? I mean, that really, really, really bothered her from watching my video. You can't please everybody, you know? So, I do thank the people who do still watch me, though. I do. So, yeah. I'm going to cover up my little dark... My little dark side marks really don't give me problem with my... Under my makeup, but I'll still cover it since we're covering correct that. Oh, and I got this little nasty little... I guess that was a pimple at one point. I'm just going to use my, um... What is this? My regular e.l.f. Um, foundation brush. So next I'm going to take my Maybelline um, Dewy Fit Me Dewy um, foundation in 355. I definitely need to get um, 360 but every time I have some change they don't have it in stocks. Blotch it onto my face and um, yeah. I mean this one works okay. I have a I'm getting on my lip. I have a problem with sweating on my upper lip and it ruins my makeup. Maybe it's because of the hair that curves around my lips. <laughs> on that, I don't know. I don't know. It's just some reason why I sweat above my lip. Maybe that's where my sweat glands are most active. I don't know. But I'm just using this little Bobbi Brown sponge that I got from... Um, one of the hair vendors on AliExpress, Ali Pure Hair. I will have their videos linked below. They send amazing Bobbi Brown brushes. I don't know if they're real or not, but they could be because Bobbi Brown brush, um, not brushes, um, sponges are about five bucks, so they could be real. No telling. Yeah, that's what I've been using lately because I've been too lazy to actually clean my brushes, which I need to get over it. And I know sponges hold bacteria and stuff. This is my second one. I still have the other one. I'm going to try to clean it. Or I'm going to see if I can find um, these online on eBay somewhere. Just going to do something simple. I'm taking this brush that I got off of eBay. A couple of cents. Um, 224 brush. I think it's supposed to be like a dupe for the MAC 224. I don't know. But I'll probably do a video on it. So I'm going to go into my contour shade. Which is Rich Mahogany. And I'm going to apply that to my crease area. I don't know. Like. The Rich Mahogany powder used to be darker um, a while ago. I don't know if they changed up the formula and Black Radiance, but it used to be a little darker. But now it seems to be my skin tone now. And that was like my favorite contour color. So yeah, well transition and contour color. So yeah, I'm just going to blend that in. I'm just going to continue applying the Rich Mahogany to my eyelid. Um, cause I don't know what kind of eye I want to do today. 
Just something regular, smegular, just a brown eye, I guess. Something very neutral and warm. I'm just gonna do my little regular triangle under the eye. It's like regular. I don't know, if um, highlighting goes out of style, I'm still gonna be doing it. Hmm, I don't like it. Not because it makes me look like a whole other complexion light or anything, but it just, um, I don't know, like, gives my look a certain look. Like, you know how flavoring to food? Yeah. Gonna take my handy dandy sponge again and just blend that in. <laughs> Cocoa. I haven't used this for contour in a while, but I am running low on my Black Radiance Concealer Stick. So, I'm just going to attempt the contour with it. I think I stopped using it for a reason. Maybe because it was, wasn't was dark enough. So I'm going to take this little um, contour brush that I got from eBay as well. And I love it. I will try to have the link below if I can find the, the link. I'm trying to avoid my baby hair. This is possible. Um, I changed my little routine. I still use my ORS Edge Control, but I actually use my Eco Styler Gel. Then I tie my hair up and I let it sit dry and they lay down for forever. And I'll just probably use the ORS Edge Control for um, like a backup. I don't know why I actually stopped using Dark Cocoa to contour with because I actually like it. I didn't think it was going to show, but it did. And try to blend that in. Cause it is a little harsh up there so i'm just going to use my nyc liquid eyeliner i don't know the name of it because it's like rubbed off um i my holy grail that i always use was my elf one i'm like let me try it up and test it up a bit and get another one i saw the glam twins use um one of them i don't know if both of them do but um they use this and i was like okay let me try it it's very inexpensive it kind of might be replacing my um elf liquid eyeliner oh, crap and i made the See, that's another thing for me. I can't make it too thick because I really don't have eyelid space. It look like this thing took flight and curved somewhere. Ugh. Yeah, I can't do it on camera. <laughs> but yeah, I'll just try. I'm supposed to make it wing out, cross over like that. But one of them always curve and take flight somewhere else. You know, this one came out perfect. My wings don't match. One's taking flight somewhere else, and the other one's just smooth sailing. Now I'm using NYC Sky Rise Mascara. I haven't found a good Holy Grail mascara. It was the Elf Lengthening and Volumizing Mascara, but I think they changed their formula, and it's a little bit too watery. Um, This one's okay. It's not my all-time favorite, but it'll do. Um, apply some lashes. I got these lashes off of eBay. Um, I don't know how good they are. I think they're duplicates for the red cherry. I don't think they're actually red cherry lashes. I think I got these for like a couple of cents. I'll try the whiskeys. They feel very thin. It doesn't feel like you have like butterflies attached to your eye. But we're gonna let that dry and we're gonna do our lips. Just gonna line, outline my lip basically. And I kind of been going over my actual lip line to just make my lips look fuller. So, uh. I don't know, it's like my lips look a little fuller. They are already full, but a little fuller. I feel like I'm not actually going over the line a little bit. I'm just going above the natural line. A little sloppy, but... Yeah, I'm going to go in with LA Girl. I'm about to say LA Girl. Colourpop's Tansy um, Ultra Matte, um, no, Ultra Satin Lippy. I look like a clown with it over line. I was trying to try something new. But I'm going to put Enchant it down. I like to put it like right where my highlight is at. And I'm going to take some and put it down my nose, above my cupids, and like really on the tip. Okay, so I'm probably going to pair Limbo with it, maybe on the outside. I don't know. So this is my complete look. Um, I had to stop because my battery actually died. I didn't do anything new to my face. Um, everything I showed you in this video, where well, I just changed my hair and my shirt, my top. Um, but yeah, I changed the, I guess, 
the camera got changed so the lighting probably was different in the video from what you see now i have the actual you know light above the camera but yeah this is what it looks like just a simple basic neutral eye and i wanted to talk to y'all in between because i know a lot of y'all say well one person was like oh we miss your old videos um so yeah i wanted to do something a little limpy and chit chatty because i really i really don't talk that much so that's why everyone this video might be partial music partial me talking but again if you want to see a bra tutorial i have that separate um i'll probably put it in this video right here you can watch that video on how i do my brows and my hair my hair is actually the long key hair that i just recently did a um actual review on and i just threw some flexi rods in it and this is the flexi rods at the end of the day like brushed out and whatnot it has like a little wave to it um so really really cute i will have more information about this hair link below keep messing my hair i will have more information about this hair link below and my top is from fashion nova um which i probably need to do a uh, actual another fashion nova haul maybe like a talk through with tell you dolls about how the pieces actually fit so yeah um i'm done i'm finna get off this camera because i have to do another video but yeah this is how the look came out i hope you guys enjoyed this quick little chit chat video and i'll see you in the next one bye